Hey folks, I wasn't planning on showing any more P08 Luger holsters, but there's no stitching on that strap. It has been glued on, which I think I've made pretty clear in the past that that's not the way to do this kind of repair. It's pretty simple to send something out to me. I stitch it up and off you go. Now I've got to mess with somebody else's mistake or somebody else's boo-boo of using glue. I tell you guys all the time, don't glue this stuff together. Stitching it's easy. Alright, let's get down on a bench here and figure out how we're going to get this loose. And uh, everything's in such good shape, I don't want to damage anything. I want to be extremely careful with this. So that's what I'm going to do. well so it's not in the right position either but that's really kind of beside the point right now what I'm gonna try is I've got just a little bit of acetone here um, because this is like I don't know what kind of glue they use it's like a rubber cement and I'm gonna use a paintbrush just to kind of control where it goes And it'll take more than just a little bit, but oh, yeah, it's working. I really need it to to come loose and keep everything intact. My concern about using acetone is that uh, it could affect the leather in a negative way. So I'm hoping not to use any more of it than I have to. At very least, it's loosening things up. They didn't even pull the stitches out when they did this. They just left them in there because the stitches are right here in the back. So really easy I can see where they backstitched, where they didn't backstitch. All that right on the back here. The knot was obviously tied under beneath the strap. There we go. Now all I need to do is clean up the glue, which hopefully is just going to kind of roll off. So far so good.
where I'm running into the biggest problem right now is uh, the stitches. This is a really nice example of a holster that's been taken care of. The leather is in immaculate condition, well, as close to as immaculate as you can get uh, with a nineteen thirty seven holster sheen a spring chicken. But hey, this stuff's coming off. I'm pretty happy about that. So if you ever find yourself doing a repair like this, be exceptionally careful. Use whatever you're using to, to dissolve to try to dissolve the glue. I didn't know what kind of glue was on here. Um, I was taking a guess that it was rubber cement. Well, not really a guess. It's kind of a an educated guess, I suppose you'd say. Um, a hypothesis. You know what that is? Um, but all the glue came off of this side, inside still okay, they kind of mucked it up a little bit, um, when they were doing whatever they did here they kind of scuffed the leather, uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put some Connellys on here, this is in such nice shape, I'm just going to, I'm just going to clean that area that was under the glue, um, because that's going to need it. And then I'll go about getting the glue off of the strap, which shouldn't be any more difficult. It's just kind of peeling off. Pretty nice. I try to make it clear to customers that, that are sending these in with issues like this because I'm not going to be responsible. I have methods of doing it and most of the time they work just fine but not all the time. So don't get your hopes too high. <laughs> That's something. I think I got a couple of them. Ooh. I'm going to add some black dye on it. That's okay. There's some glue down here below the stitching. I don't want to have any chance of that trying to uh, re stick to the holster. all coming off so I'm pretty happy about that I'll get this done I'm gonna stitch it back up off camera you guys have seen that a dozen times at least if you watched back in my videos um, but I'll get it stitched up and I'll show you the finished product uh, I will give this a little bit of a cleaning I see some there's a lot of dirt down here 
So I'll give it a good cleaning just to take care of some of that. Well folks, there you are. A once glued on strap is stitched back on correctly. It was a pretty easy repair. The leather's in fantastic shape, so it was very easy to do it. Um, I don't know what the black is. I suspect that this may have been one of the brown holsters that was re-dyed to black. That's about the only explanation I have for that. Um, my thread color, I don't know if you'll be able to see any of the other stitching there be able to tell but my color came out pretty darn good I'm pretty happy with it I mean aside from there's dirt in there that I can't replicate so it turned out great I'm really happy with the repair hope my customer is too I'll find out soon enough um, that being said y'all stay safe God bless drop a comment down below hit that like button it only takes a second and it doesn't cost a penny <laughs> and uh Go ahead and subscribe if you want to see some more of this. I've got some pretty interesting stuff coming up that y'all might like. We'll catch you in the next video. Thanks for watching.